Hey everybody, welcome back to another diecast review. Today we're taking a look at Chase Elliott's 2020 Charlotte Roval win. This is the second year in a row where he was able to win at the Roval. And so we're going to go ahead and take a look at the race win 164th now. But we'll start with the box. You can see over here we've got Chase Elliott and Hendrick Motorsports, ages 4 and up. And then a window to the car, which has a little more damage on it than I thought it would. On the roof, or the top, we have uh, Action Racing Collectibles and then the NASCAR Hologram. Also with a apparent choking hazard. Um, huh. Apparently, I, I might have to point this out, not a choking hazard in 2021. That's right, kids got smarter. We don't have to have choking hazard on here anymore. How about them apples? It's probably in the bottom I'm looking for it. I don't see it, though. I don't see a choking hazard on the new ones, or on the old ones, so, yeah, interesting. Uh, anyway, let's go ahead and get onto the car here. So, with this car, you can see we do have some rubber buildup up along the right, left, or sorry, the, yeah, left front fender, and right around the back side of the wheel well, we got our number nine, the arrow for the uh, jack post is there. You can see the dirt kind of sprinkled around the right side here. Um, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. He, yeah, he was sponsored by Mountain Dew in 2020. It was throwing me for a loop. I was like, wait a minute. Where'd that Mountain Dew logo come from? But I forgot he was still sponsored by Mountain Dew last year. So uh, we do have the Mountain Dew logo there. We got Unifirst on the back. Uh, the ethanol ring as well. Napa Auto Parts. Uh, we got his three winner stickers up there, I think. I can't see. Uh, I'm only seeing two. It was his third win, so they should have had at least that third one up there. But uh, on the roof, we got our blue number nine. You can see what I got on the hood as well. We got that blue number nine everywhere. Uh, you go to the right side of the car. We've got uh, more of that dirt along the right front corner and the right side. Um, pretty tame though when you get around to the back. No big dents or anything like that. Uh, we got our silver or uh, white playoff banner there. Uh, you can see we've got two winner stickers, so yeah, they didn't add the winner sticker on this one, but Elliott on the rear window, playoffs on the front windshield banner, so we do have both the banners, and Napa Auto Care on the back. You get to the very nose of the car, you can see we do have some tape on the grill, and then just some dirt down along the splitter, but otherwise, pretty clean. He did keep this one a lot cleaner than the uh, 2019 edition of the Roval, so that had to have helped a little bit, but um, yeah, it, it was uh, certainly another uh, example of Chase Elliott being good at road courses, which we all basically by now know, not really a shock, so uh, anyway... That is pretty much all I have on this diecast. Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. Also, turn on the notification bell and subscribe for more diecast content. Um, but otherwise, this has been Race Craze. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next diecast review.